So, was I able to solo Disney's Toontown Online? The answer is a little complicated. If you want the short variant, then no. The CJ was deemed incompletable, as I can only do it at the lowest difficulty tier, which, ironically enough, makes it harder as a solo due to the lack of bonus weight. If I happen to be proven wrong though, then it would legitimately be awesome, and give me a reason to revisit this challenge. Currently though, I do find it to be impossible. But if we factor exclusively mandatory content, being the task line itself, then yes, I was able to solo the entirety of the Toontown Online task line, and it has been proven to be theoretically possible for Wordless. But as I mentioned in the Boss Bot Soup Part section, I had started to use rewards in the Front 3 runs after the first Front 3, which was done rewardless. I do not consider level 7s to be rewards personally, even if they are powerful tools, as you earn them the same way as you would other gags, and their impact is always felt due to their contribution to track XP. Regardless, for some fun stats, I do have a few notes. This challenge was done from starting Toontown Central on April 29th, 2023, to beating the CEO on October 14th of that same year. All mandatory content in TTO, plus the boss solos, totaled up to 78 hours to complete. This does not include the failed VP attempts or auto-grinding, which adds much more time. While it took me 201 attempts to beat the VP, all other bosses were done as a first try regardless of outcome. I had died, ran or teleported away, or forcefully disconnected in a total of 258 fights, buildings, facilities, and boss runs. Excluding the 200 VP disconnects, these happened 58 times throughout the task line. In general, this run was a lot of fun. There were frustrating moments of course, but it was a run that really tested my capabilities on resource management, and actually working around TTO's quirks, such as the lure knockback bug and carryover, a mechanic I never actually utilized back when I did play TTO. Would I say it's the hardest Toontown challenge I've done? I'm not sure, as there's perhaps a couple more I want to try out in the future, primarily involving Toontown Rewritten. We'll see when I get to that, though.